of YouTube later. My name is Wildboy569 and welcome to this. Today I wanted to show, I want to make this quick video because I got a word today and I wanted to get two uploads today like I've been doing the last few days. But today I'm going to show you the four Nintendo Switch games I have so far. Now, uh, a couple of days ago I bought me a Nintendo Switch brand new out of the box from Walmart, really cool and all that. And I bought me a couple of games that I wanted to show you guys and see what you think about them. So I have three games and believe it or not, four of them are some of the Hedgehog games. But I wanted to show you because I thought these games I have were really cool. So the first one I wanted to show is... Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Now, from what I heard, this game is really expensive because it's really hard to find. But I found this in my local game store for 45 bucks, And it's really cool. You get Super Mario Super Mario 3D All-Stars is what I mean. I'm sorry. Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Which has Super Mario 64, Super Mario Sunshine, and Super Mario Galaxy. I have played Super Mario 64. I still have the original cartridges on my Nintendo 64. I just played Super Mario Sunshine. I have not played Super Mario Galaxy yet. So, but I will play these and give you my thoughts on them eventually. So, here's the front. We got the spine. In the back, it shows three games and no booklet or anything, but there's the tiny little card that you stick into the game. So there is Super Mario 3D All Stars. Next up, we have is a racing game, and that is Team Sonic Racing. Now, this is a game I had on the PS4. It's actually a really fun game, but I do prefer Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing a way better. Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing is a lot better. So this game was a hard to do at first, but I eventually got the hang of it. So here's the front. You got the spine. And the battle keeping that in. I don't know why I'm keeping that in, but got the fun and all that. And we have the little cartridge. Let me get the cartridge out. And there you can a little bit of cartridge right there. So that is Team Sonic Racing. Next up we have is the parallel game, a very popular game that people love. Probably most people love this game, and that is Sonic Mania. I have not played this game yet. I'm about to pop it in the Nintendo Switch as soon as I get done recording, but this is Sonic Mania. It was released in 2017 as part of the main Sonic in the Sonic series. And you got, on the front, you got Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. You got the front, spine, and the bag. You got Dr. Robotic. And mainly, this game, you can play uh, the older levels from the Sega Genesis with updated stuff. And all that. So I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, you get this little code thing. Make sure I don't show the code. You got one of these. And then you got the little cartridge that you... Yeah, there we go. Shit. I don't want to lose these with these, so you can be hard to find. So there's the cartridge. And that... Is Sonic Mania. Now the last game we have... Is a game I haven't played yet. And that is Sonic Colors. I brought this brand new out one more the same day I got my Nintendo Switch. Because I wanted this, so so I wanted this Nintendo Switch game. But I wanted to get... I was planning on getting... Uh, Super Mario Maker 2, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And uh, another Mario game. So here's the front. Spine. And the back, and we have the cartridge as usable. And like, these actually taste really bad. I did my dumbass one of the taste and see if it actually was bad, and it tastes like hand sanitizer. So there is Sonic Mania, so Sonic Colors. So there's so, so you guys one more time. There's Sonic Colors, Sonic Mania, Team Sonic Racing, and Super Mario 3D All Star. So that is my Nintendo Switch selection so far. I plan on getting more Nintendo Switch games, obviously, because I love it so far. And I do have a couple of digital games. I have Pokemon on Unite or Unlimited or something. I played on live stream with Lightning with Lightning Guy, and I also got the first digital copy of uh, Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. And I plan on getting the physical copy of Nintendo Switch, maybe PS4 Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. They push that physical copy released so many times. They said the last, they re uh, was supposed to be released the same day as the digital version, which was June 30th. They pushed it back to August something, and then they pushed it back to uh, September 22nd, which is actually today. Today's actually the fourth year anniversary of Doki Doki Literature Club, so happy anniversary to the Doki Doki Literature Club. And got pushed back again to October 8th. They said that'll be the last time it'll be delayed. Who knows, hopefully. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to remember a thumbs up, come subscribe, check out my social media down below. As always, thank you guys a lot for watching, and I will see you all in a future video. Take it easy.